the final decomposition of DIT FFT algorithm to find DFT so basically what we did was we had 8 point DFT sequence X of K so we decomposed it into two 4 point DFT sequence of G of K and H of K so this, are, this, this is 4 point sequence and this is four point sequence right and again g of k we decomposed it into two two point uh, sequence of a of k and b of k and h of k we decomposed this into two two point sequence of c of k and this is d of k right where g of k is all the even samples of x of n and h of k is dft of all the odd samples of x of n and again this is uh, this corresponds to even of g odd samples of g this corresponds to this corresponds to even samples of h and this corresponds to odd samples of h now one last decomposition is so this is actually two point this is two point so, uh, this is also two point this is also two point now i have to again decompose this into two one point dft so this one point dft one point dft and we shall call this as i of k and we will call this as j of k right and we are going to decompose these two into one point uh, dft and we will call this as l of k we will call it as m of k and we will again this has to be decomposed into two one point dft n we will call it as n of k and this called it as sorry o of k I'm just randomly choosing these letters, okay? So, and these two again, this D of K sequence, I'm going to decompose it into P of K and this into Q of K. And all these are one point DFTs. Fine. So now I will. I am not going to do any mathematics for uh, to derive the equation for this. Uh, by this time, you might have got some idea how to uh, decompose the uh, X of K sequence. So let me directly write this I J L M N O P Q equation. Okay. So I of K is equal to what? Sorry, A of K. C of K is equal to combination of i of k j of k right so a of k is equal to what so a of k is equal to i of k plus w 2 power k into j of k this is for k is equal to 0 and a of k is equal to i of k plus 1 plus w 2 power k into j of k plus 1 but i of k plus 1 is equal to i of k because it's a periodic sequence and this is for k is equal to 1 and b of k is equal to l of k plus w2 power k into m of k this is for k is equal to 0 and b of k is equal to l of k plus 1 plus w2 power k into m of k plus 1 for k is equal to 1 and c of k is equal to n of k plus w2 power k into o of k and c of k is equal to n of k plus 1 plus w2 power k into o of k plus 1 this is for k is equal to 0 and this is for k is equal to 1 and similarly d of k is equal to p of k plus w2 power k into q of k this is for k is equal to 0 and d of k is equal to p of k plus 1 plus w2 power k into q of k plus 1 and this is for k is equal to 1 now if you trace uh, the input samples in terms of x of n so this i of k corresponds to x of 0 and j of k corresponds to x of 4 
any of both these two are same so and b of k corresponds to x of 2 and uh, sorry l of k corresponds to x of 2 and m of k corresponds to x of 6 similarly n of k corresponds to x of 1 and o of k corresponds to x of 5 p of k corresponds to x of 3 and q of k corresponds to x of 7 so let me tell you how did I write this so what we had was x of n sequence right and this x of n sequence we decomposed it into g of n sequence and h of n sequence and this g of n sequence corresponds to what even sequence x of 0 x of 2 x of 4 and x of 6 right and h of n corresponds to odd sequence x of 1 x of 3 x of 5 and x of 7 right and this g of n sequence we decompose into 2 a of n sequence and b of n sequence and this a of n sequence is what even samples of g of n which is x of 0 and x of 4 and b of n is odd of g of n which is x of 2 and x of 6 right and similarly this h of n sequence we decompose into c of n and d of n and this c of n is even sample of h of n which is x of 1 and x of 5 and d of n is odd sample of h of n which is x of 3 and x of 7 right and now the final stage is a of n we are decomposing into two one point dft let me write it here itself so this corresponds to what x0 and this corresponds to what x4 right and what is this this is i of n this is i of n and this is j of n so i of n corresponds to x of 0 j of n corresponds to x of 4 and uh, l of n and m of n so l of n corresponds to x of 2 and m of n corresponds to x of 6 so x of 2 and x of 6 similarly these two x of 1 and x of 5 and these two are x of 3 and x of 7 so this is how we wrote uh, the corresponding samples in time domain now we have to write the signal flow graph uh, of the final stage decomposition so what do we have here is x of 0 and x of 4 right so let me write it x of 0 and x of 4 so what is a of k uh, let me just draw the line uh, this is a of 0 and this corresponds to a of 1 so what is a of 0 this corresponds to for k is equal to 0 a of 0 is what i of 0 plus w2 power 0 into j of 0 but what is i of 0 corresponds to x of 0 right so it is nothing but x of 0 plus w2 power 0 into x of 4 so x of 0 is there x of 4 I need to scale it by w2 power 0 and what about a of 1 so a of 1 is equal to what uh, x of 0 plus w2 power 1 into x of 4 so x of 0 is here this is added with w2 power 1 of x of 4 so which I get is a of 1 right so similarly let me extend this line so this corresponds to x of 2 and x of 6 and these two corresponds to x of 1 and x of 5 and these two corresponds to x of 3 and x of 7 and the same pattern repeats here four times this is b of 0 this is b of 1 this is scaled by w2 power 0 and this is scaled by w2 power 1 this is c of 0 this is c of 1 so this is scaled by w2 power 0 this is scaled by w2 power 1 so this is d of 0 this is d of 1 this is scaled by w2 power 0 and this is scaled by w2 power 1 so this is the final stage decomposition of the algorithm now output of this 
has to go to where output of this so this was the second stage decomposition so this black black box so we have decomposed like this now so what are this a of 0 a of 1 b of 0 b of 1 c and d so we have here now output of this has to be cascaded with has to be cascaded with these two flow graph these two flow graph these two stage so this is w4 power 0 this is w4 power 2 so this is w4 power 1 this is w4 power 3 and this is w4 power 0 this is w4 power 1 this is w4 power 2 and this is w4 power 3 and what is this g of 0 g of 1 g of 2 g of 3 g of uh, h of 0 h of 1 h of 2 and h of 3 now the final stage decomposition is so this is w 8 power 0 x of 5, x of 6 and x of 7.